All right, folks, welcome to Lake Max and Cookie Memorial Day weekend. It's Friday. Uh, figured I'd get out here for four or five hours before the pleasure boaters take over everything. So all we're going to do is try to catch as many fish as we can. I don't care if it's walleye, largemouth, red eye. I don't care. Like I said, Memorial Day weekend, every fisherman knows you really can't fish any decent lake because the pleasure boaters will just destroy it. So four or five hours, let's see what we can do. There's one. Little guy. And you know what it is. <laughs> well. Of course we were going to catch one of these guys. We've got a storm blowing in. I don't know if it's going to help us or hurt us any. Oh, there's another one. Feels like another red eye. Definitely not fighting like a smallie. Nope. Another red eye. Fun to catch, but not. Ah! Not what we're looking for. Big meaty guys. That feels like another red eye. Dang it. Well, I've hit a school of red eye. That is a stud though. Oh my God. Look at the size of this one. <laughs> I should have just called the video red eye, rock bass, whatever you want to call them. That's a stud. There's a good one. Another rock bass. Dang it. Another stud though. This is even bigger. Jeez. That was on the Chucky's Baits vibrating jig and my Yoder's custom rod there. I switched it up a little bit, but look how big. That is a giant. Whatever. Should just keep them. There's one. You wouldn't believe it. Another red eye on the Ned rig this time. Jeez. Listen. I mean, I'm catching fish. <laughs> little turd. Oh, he might not even come in. I got him on a little there he is. Come on, bud. He's doing everything he can to get off. Well, we found a bass. Had to come to the channels, which is something I don't really like to do. But you can catch a few bass. That's not a what we're looking for, but I'm just throwing a worm around. Storm clouds are getting closer. I've been here about an hour and a half. All I've found is red eye. So I figure I'll dive in the channels real quick, maybe get lucky and find a couple of decent bass. So far, no good. Got it. A male garden. Real good fish. Well, that's our first keeper bass. That's not bad. That's about a 15, 15 and a half incher. Nice size fish. Post spawn. Hey, got a couple now. this guy. Hey listen, we're just going to call it a multi-species day. Look at this fat little joker. It's 
see a lot of people calling green sunfish warmouth. That, folks, is a warmouth. And she's full of eggs. Hey, that's three species in two hours and ten minutes. That's how long we've been here so far. Uh, clouds are getting a little scary. We'll just keep going until we can't. There we go. There's a fish. Up in the eye. There we go. That's four species, folks. Boat flipped him on 10 pound test. Probably shouldn't have done that, but there we go. That's our first keeper smallie. Not huge. Another 15 incher, but smoked jerk bait. We've made a day of it. As you can see, the rain has started, but it kind of quit real quick. I was getting ready to leave, and uh, it lightened up super fast. So I was like, well, I'll give it a little more time. So let's see if we catch a few more. There's a good one. There he is. It's my. Ooh, nice. Okay, when I said good one, I meant it's a fish. That's all it is, is a fish. Not a good one. There he is. Better fish. Not huge, but a better fish. The jerk bait bite is so much fun. Well, look what we have here. This is what everybody's still out here looking for. Look who made an appearance. Mr. Walter pretty nice one too really that's a keeper I don't know how many species that is rain's coming down pretty good now like I said a few more casts if I get a bite I'll stay if I don't I gotta go there we go Walleye are biting now. It's gonna be hard to leave. That's my second walleye. I'm not sure if the camera was recording or not. There's so much rain. I had to take the microphone off of it because it was getting soaked. This was not a keeper. The other one was a good 16, 17 inches. This one's, I don't think, quite there. better one oh. that's why he felt better it's a large head that's only our third keeper largemouth that's mm, that's the best largemouth for sure and he's got it good yeah fat guy probably a 15 inch largemouth <laughs> what do you know we actually put a decent day together. Oh, that one smoked it. That was, that was the best bite. I don't know if it's the best fish. Best bite for sure. I don't even know if the volume, that camera's soaked. Flipping Walters. He lost a brain cell or two, but that's pretty good. Ooh. Can you even see? I don't know if you can hear or anything. I'm trying, guys. It's pouring. Another good keeper size walleye. Pretty happy about that. Having a good time. Lost a brain cell or two, but he swam away pretty good. Swam, swam. You know what he did.
there was a big bite. I don't know how he didn't get it. Got it. I don't know if it's the same one. Feels like a good fish. Feels like a real good fish. Not huge, but a heck of a fighter. Smoking the walleye. If that means anything to anybody. I mean, that's another keeper size. Not huge, but. All right, we caught five species. Uh, I could stay out here and get soaked, but I'm really running short on time now. And I'm going to get out of here. The rain's coming down really good. Probably not the most impressive day you've ever seen, but it was fun. I got out here just for a few hours, got out before the rain and before the major traffic starts for Memorial Day weekend. And uh, that's it. That's Mac Kentucky, five species day. Had a pretty good time, so until next time.